so for sagittarius for the month of december what's coming in for you hope you guys are doing well the person on your mind let's start with your energy first right now you guys are waiting on changes okay um you, you're possibly waiting to see if this person would change themselves to be a better fit for you some of you guys are waiting on a new option like some of you are just waiting for your person to reach out okay in terms of your finances i i believe you're waiting for the uh, positive uh, changes i don't think uh, things are going very well right now okay things seems a bit stagnant okay with the moon card you have lots of doubt lots of fears re relating to your situation with your person okay you have major trust issues at this moment for the ongoing situation or the way things are going okay with three of pentacles i still believe you are wanting to give it another chance you're wanting to see whether this person is capable of changing themselves or not i don't think you're quitting on them so soon okay in terms of your person your person as well with the three of wands is very distant from you or uh, they have their back turned away from you in terms of their major energy major energy i don't think they'll be able to stay away from you for long okay even if they are behaving distant this person is still thinking about you you're still very much on their mind okay in terms of the future action future action with the elephant card this person will realize that you are a important part of their life and they cannot escape this they cannot replace this or uh, you are the best they've got okay that realization will push them to come forward okay in terms of the past energy past energy you guys could have had some sort of um, disagreement some sort of, uh, sort of difference which pushed the two of you away from each other okay some fight some argument or some news that you got to know about them um kind of hurt your feelings okay their actions could have also hurt your feelings uh, action or lack of action in terms of that their major feelings at this time major feelings to the ace of wands i mean they are hiding their interest in you okay maybe you could have said uh, things uh, which they could have taken very personally even if they've got some genuine feelings for you this person is still hiding it they are proving a point that they can stay without you it's like they are i mean they are trying to give you that uh, silent treatment okay but deep down they are still very much manifesting this in terms of that what is currently going on with the queen of pentacles i do believe um, this person at this moment finds themselves like very much thinking about you like very much wanting you they find themselves super attached to you they are very drawn to your energy i think you bring in a lot of stable like energy this could have started based on attraction but it's going to be a lot more now okay in terms of their head space head space this person can uh, some some like somewhat behave like unbothered uh, they tend to show you that they they do not give a shit about this connection but but that's just their nature okay this person still needs to heal themselves work on themselves i still believe this person got some in inner work that they need to focus on uh, i also feel sometimes this person focuses on on their financial life more than their emotional life i i also feel some of them not all um their love language is to gi is to give you that i would say financially stable life uh, they are not very much the emotional types they are more of the practical types i will not be surprised if some of you guys have attached yourself to an earth sign virgo taurus capricorn in terms of their major intentions at this moment intention is to very much return back to you then what is stopping them what's really getting in the way what's getting in the way is the judgment that decision making okay i i believe that some outside influence is definitely triggering them to do otherwise this person at this moment is stuck like whether they need to give in they need to surrender or hold back and wait on you okay in terms of how do they view this connection with you the high priestess they still sense a connection regardless whether you guys are on talking terms like whether you guys are together distant away third party it doesn't matter 
this person still sends us some bit of uh, energetic pull to you okay and it's not going anywhere in terms of that what do they want with you with the strength card they will still want to hold on to this the moment they feel you're going away they'll chase you trust me on that okay that being said in terms of um, the major blockages Major blockages for now this person isn't ready for that commitment that you might be expecting from them. I, I, I believe you were wanting this person to, to give you some bit of security in this connection. But uh, I still believe uh, this, this, this person isn't ready for more. I mean they are willing to be a, a part of you but it's still in like in that dating phase. What else? With the page of cups this person hasn't been quite emotionally expressive so you you tend to get confused like whether this person wants you or, or they are just playing with you what else and with the two of wands sometimes you feel like an option in their life and that triggers you that bothers you okay so in terms of that how will they express themselves and what's going to get in the way in the near future I do feel with the temperance card this person will show up if, if like if if not sooner this person will show up after the 7th of December this person has the intentions of wanting to balance this connection they are going nowhere they very much want you trust me on that in terms of that with the hermit card what might get in the way is the silent treatment this might confuse you a lot okay why is this happening with the eight of pentacles i do feel this person tends to give their financial life the priority uh, and they do not focus more on the connection on the emotional bond they have with you and that in a way might continue okay so if you do not adjust well to that then this connection might end up hurting you but let's see the long term outcome is it worth holding on to With the emperor card if you guys both show patience and you both compromise on some of your ways i mean then i i feel it's quite worth the wait okay like bottom card with the ten of wands i mean they are willing to be a part of you they are willing to put in that work that effort to keep going in this connection okay that being said why are you experiencing this what's the major blockage that you need to know about why are you experiencing this the first thing is the ego clash okay i still believe this person is not willing to completely let go of what they believe or what they feel is right okay this person is a bit stubborn a uh, bit egoistic how will they be approaching you next i still feel even if they approach you that emotional uh, connect or them having to be emotionally expressive that's going to be missing Okay, this person will take some time to open up even if they i mean they are on cordial terms with you you might have noticed that they are not very comfortable having to connect on an emotional level now why is that and how should you move forward with this i i still believe that this like person finds themselves um blocked in in some which way okay uh, they might have gone through some painful connection in the past and they do, they do not quite want to repeat that in their life unless they are fully comfortable with you i don't see this person opening up but can you expect some bit of change in the coming days certainly okay the more you guys spend time in uh, together and i do not mean through communication i i mean in the physical one on one that's how this person will uh, be able to give in more okay um what are they expecting from you with the four of wands they, they want you to stay they very much want you to be a part of them okay and uh, if you stay what can you expect from this person with ace of cups if you stay then your patience will quite be re uh, rewarded in a big way this person will give in emotionally okay but this can take nothing less than two or three months to fully get to that stage okay slowly bit by bit step by step this person will make you feel comfortable and belonged okay so moving on to messages 
So moving on to messages, the first message we have is finances. I'm busy with work right now and it requires my attention. I believe the finances or their work life or their career option is directly getting in the way. Okay, they were more focused on their finances than their love life, just like I've said earlier. And secondly, their major fear, loss. I feel like I've lost you and I'm not coping well with it. Okay, moving on to their intentions. I'm blocked by my fears. True intimacy is putting me at risk of getting hurt. Okay, following we have, don't be needy love. Uh, I want to challenge you to become independent and uh, feel free in our relationship. This could very much come off in a form of a lesson for some of you. Okay, this person is pushing you to, uh, towards your limits because I think some of you, not all, were very much dependent on them to feel good about yourself. And if this person uh, tends to hold back, that hurts you directly. And some of you guys have been uh, um, working on your dependency issues okay and finally we have very soon i'm going to sweep you off your feet i want to win your heart okay that being said let's move on to sagittarius who are dealing with air sign what's going on all of you who, who believe in manifestation could come in five 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 for changes for air sign i believe uh, with the four of swords in the reverse this person could have just given up on this connection or you felt like this person had given up on this connection like this person was nowhere to be seen like with the lovers card i won't be surprised if they messed up with a third party okay in terms of what they want with you now with the nine of wands this person will still bring in some bit of resistance overall what can you expect five of pentacles if you're dealing with an air sign particularly libra gemini aquarius this person might continue to hold back for a while, nothing less than five days. I do believe uh, they are guilty for having to uh, lie to you or having to um, hide something from you. And they, and they do not know how to approach you. So that might get in the way. For those who are dealing with water, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Five of Wands. It seemed like you, you, you guys were not compatible. You guys kept fighting, kept arguing, kept bringing out the worst in each other. Eight of Cups, this person was just not available or just not emotionally available. They just kept staying distant. With the Empress card, I do believe this person will realize your value once they've lost you. So if you maintain that silence, this person will like, very much be triggered. And that's going to be the only way they realize your worth and come back. Otherwise, they'll maintain that distance. For those dealing with Fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This person seems more keen on coming forward. With Nine of Swords, I do feel like this person is restless without you. And with Four of Cups, they feel rejected by your silence right now. Now that you're not giving in, they are very fearful. Okay, for most of you, this person will want to give in sooner than you think. If they are already on good talking terms, they might discuss some personal matter with you. They will take that bold decision of having to discuss their personal life so that you know them on a deeper level. Moving on to Earth signs. Earth sign with the Wheel of Fortune, I do believe. Uh, you guys have gone through the extreme, the good and the bad with this person. And this person too is very extreme. If 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 they are good with you, they are very good. And if, if they are not interested, they just hold back completely with the star card i still believe this person wants this they are still manifesting it i i i feel they are mean uh, they are looking forward towards getting back and with the knight of wands fire and earth looks very good okay air is something that you guys need to uh, take care of overall i feel you guys can expect a message uh, but if you guys still find yourself in a toxic situation you guys should uh, think about the long term if it's good okay temporary happiness doesn't really matter okay long term happiness is what you need to focus on especially if you're in a relationship that being said if you still find yourself in a toxic situation and you want more guidance you could go for a personal reading you could go and book on etsy divine love tarot by sai or you could come via whatsapp uh, all those who believe in manifestation can come in 555 for changes uh, thank you so much for coming in. Please like the video. Your like goes a big way for us. Also subscribe for more regular content. Thank you so much and I hope to see you soon guys. Cheers.